welcome to Tangling Along With Me. Today we are continuing on tanglepatterns.com and we are making this pattern here. So let's find our page and get started. I'm using my Micron 01 and I need to find a place where I can put this tangle. Um, and I actually think it would be a bit kind of cool in this one. So I'm going to start here with a circle or a orb. And I'm making it um, quite large. And then I'm going to make these um, teardrop shapes like that. And I'm gonna do five of them. One, two, three, four, five. So one here. here and here and the last one here there we go then I am auraing the orb here and I'm going under these teardrops Like this. Uh, you could have made the teardrops a bit bigger, that would be neat too. Then I'm auraing the teardrops. I'm going from the side here and out to the tip of the teardrop. So from the side to the tip of the teardrop. And I do that on all of my teardrops. And the bigger you make your start circle, um, you can make something cool inside of the uh, orb here if you wanted to. It's easy when it's bigger and if you make the teardrops bigger, the pattern will also look kind of different. And you could continue doing this a, a longer time than I can here. So I'm going back and auraing the orb. Again, I am going behind what I already drew. So behind these teardrops all the way around. There we go. And then I'm going back to making or auras around the teardrops here. And you can continue those uh, two steps as long as you want to. In her step out she also uh, here and there put a little orb here in between these when she have done the two steps enough. So I'm just gonna do that as well. Um, and I think I'm going to make one of the uh, fragments for orbs in this one. So I am going to make a square and I am making the lines going all the way out to the side of the circle. There we go. And I'm going to color in this little square like that. So that is actually the pattern. It's kind of cute. Um, I think it would be nicer if I made it bigger in the start. Um, but my uh, places are a little too small for something big. Uh, you could make a um, tiny background patterns here. These three dots, they actually have a name as well, but I just forgot it. So this one is not a part of uh, the tangle we are doing today. I'm just uh, going to fill the background a bit here. So it's not as empty like that. I think I'm going to my blue Micron 01 
and I am going to color in these uh, teardrops here to give it a little more interest Something like that. I could color in the orbs as well. Um, should I do that? Nah, we don't. Then I'm going to my uh, graphite pencil and I think with this one I'm going to uh, pillow it out but I want some uh, shades here in this middle thing first of all. So I'm going to start here on the inside, taking my Tati Young and make it into the nice shadow we know. Make sure there's still some white um, on these places, otherwise you will just have a grey uh, feel of grey spot here instead of a shade. There we go. Um, and you could do something here as well, placing a little graphite here on where the uh, lines are meeting. Just a little, and again using the tatillion. it into the shadow there we go and just to make this really nice I am going to make a dark um, pillowing effect here on this one Again, using my tortillon, and I like these circle motions. the edge on the inside of the edge And that was the pattern for today, this one. I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Have an attitude of gratitude.